If your ink too slow and your nib won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to see you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Review. Welcome, Larry here, and welcome to my world, Larry's Fountain Pen Review, where I try to review pens of interest that you may be interested in and give you my opinion, what I think about the pen. Good or bad, bad or good, I'm going to tell you just like it is. And remember, though, we all are different. Just because I don't like something doesn't mean that you may not like it. So, the best way to always know the truth about a pen if you're able to go to a pen shop. That way you can ask the seller if you may test the pen and then you can give your own thoughts. So, right down here we have the Diplomat. And this review is presented by Lena Mini. And she is the president at Pen Boutique's Started in September 17, 2004, till present, which today is February the 6th, 2022. Wow, already. And Boutique has been around for a while. They're a leading dealer in fine writing instruments and as well as executive gifts here in the U.S. So... Lena has a lot of stuff going on there. And uh, if you ever in Maryland, Columbia, Maryland, that's where her store is at, drop in and see her sometime. Get to know her. You'll meet a very exciting, wonderful, loving, caring individual. That's who she is. She's outstanding. And here, my friends, is the diplomat. And this is how it comes. Basic cardboard box, white, black lettering. We'll open it up and take her right out. The top is kind of, it's a metal. The 
but that slides right out. And that's nicely done. I like the way Diplomat does the presentation. Yes, I do like pin cases. So, anyway, again, Diplomat, since 1922. And we'll flip this over and let you look at this beautiful fountain pen. You're looking at the Diplomat Arrow Fountain Pen, Antique Rose. Nice and secure in his bed, laying asleep before it rises up into the air. And away she goes. And we'll pull that right out. And it does come with a couple of cartridges, as you see here. And the card. And the card is not just any card, it's the International Guarantee Certificate, so you might want to look at the back of it and fill that out because you never know if you ever may need to use it. You never, ever, ever know. And we'll put all this back up. And then we're going to talk about this beautiful fountain pen. All right, here you have the Diplomat Arrow. Beautiful, stunning, antique rose. Comes in steel nib, or you can get it in a gold nib. It's got the smooth lines and a streamlined body, as you see here. And you can feel the luxury of the, of the Zeppelin. Remember the great Zeppelin? At one time that gave the famous flight high above in the sky, the Zeppelin. Aluminum casing, anodized surface, and you see the grooves on the barrel and as well as on the clip. And they all line up, match up very nicely. And the fountain pen has been finely chiseled with polish with a 14 K okay, gold nib, bicolor nib, or if you choose just to have a standard steel nib. So choices. Remember, comes with a 14 K gold nib, or you can order just with a steel nib. And we'll go ahead and remove everything here and let the Zeppelin rest for a little bit. Beautiful, stunning. Love the color. Really is a beautiful color. A little bit on specifications here pull off the barrel and it does post nice and securely for those who like to post the pens a nice rose color look to the fountain pen cartridge or converter, the grip material, resin, and I do like the way it's done, very nice, it just kind of has that look that matches the color, the clip as well. As you can see, the grip section and the clip. And we'll go to the top of the cap. And you can see it has the Diplomat logo right there. Everything is uniform, come together. A nice big section for the grip section. 
to accommodate any size fingers. As you go down the barrel, it is a broad nib. Nicely done. Nice little click. Let's hear, let hear that again. Click like that. Okay. The length of the pen. Yep. Capped, it's going to be 5.5 .5 inches long. Posted, it's going to be 6.3 inches long. The material, like I said before, is aluminum. You can get it in a gold nib or a steel nib. The gold nib is going to be 14K. So what size nib does it come in? Extra fine, fine, medium, broad for the steel nib. Gold nib comes in extra fine, fine, medium, and broad. And I do like those groove-like depressions on the barrel and cap. That, that really just makes it look sharp. It, the pen just stands out. It's Diplomat Arrow is just an incredible fountain pen. And I, in my opinion, I think at a very worthy price. Again, the chrome finish. Makes the trim. It has a two-year warranty on it. So there you have it. Right now I have it inked up with some Faber-Castell pink. All right. Now, pink, pink. Pink, pink. And thank press self-examination. Not only for women, but for men as well. Very important. You never know. And God knows we don't want any of us to get it. But when, or if we do, we all need to stand together and fight this. Come together as one and fight this horrible disease. You know, cancer doesn't care who it touches, but we care. For our loved ones, our families, our friends, and in general, for people. And here is the ink, and I'm just going to take it out of the box and show it to you. It's really a fabulous color. Wait till you see it perform. I think the color will speak for itself. So, my good friends, it has come to that time. Here we go. Isn't it pretty? That is a nice color. Beautiful color, really a sweet, sweet nib, nice, smooth, and wet. No problems with the nib whatsoever, none. Just a really nice writing instrument. Performs very well.
and you're not going to get much of, of a different line variation with the reverse riding. So there you have it. And this is a broad nib. I think I may have said a medium. Let me make sure. It is a broad nib. They put that down there. Okay, so there you have it. The Diplomat Arrow Antique Rose with some Fiber Castell Pink. Good match, really, don't you think? I think it's a really nice match. And as always, one more time, very important, I do want to spread the word. I do want people to know, to be aware, to take this serious. This is not a game. I know there's a lot of us that say, okay, yeah, I've heard about it. It's serious. All right, folks, that's going to wrap it up for today. Until next time. Be safe out there. Kind of a stranger. Peace. And lots of love to each and every one of you. And as always, please don't text and drive. And we're done. Peace out.